we were feeling close to others, then we're more likely to develop positive minds towards them, such as love and compassion. And if we're able to do this, then naturally our relationships with others will improve and also our expectations of others will really change. With um, If we start viewing others in a more positive way, then we have we more have more peace, more inner peace. Um, whilst we're having negative views of others, and it, it creates a lot of conflict um, within our mind. Uh, one exercise that's worth doing, and uh, you've got to be brave to do this exercise, <laughs> but it's something I try to do, is just uh, throughout your day, just watch your thoughts as they arise, and think about, try to sort of think, is that a positive or a negative thought? Okay, think, is that a positive or a negative thought? Okay, and, and then just, okay, just, you don't need to tell anybody these things, you just think, okay, yep, yeah, okay, that's a negative one, or yep, yeah, that's a positive one. Uh, and then what happens if you do this, you become more aware of how much time you spend allowing your mind to produce negative thoughts, right? And it sort of gives you a bit of an insight <laughs> into the way your mind is functioning. Um, and then what's helpful today with this class that we're doing today is to also, how many of your thoughts are about yourself <laughs> and how many, or let's say about your own happiness and how many of your thoughts are about others' happiness? And again, you know, some days you end up thinking, oh my God, I'm completely obsessed with myself and, and all I have is negative thoughts all the time about everybody else, right? It's, it's not. And then other di times you might think, oh, you know what? You know, I think a lot about others and and also I don't have a lot of negative thoughts, right? But it's quite, it's really, really, you've got to be really honest and really sort of watch the thought processing and then it, oh, is this a negative? Is this positive? Um, and it, it's interesting too. So if at the end of the day you feel quite exhausted and mentally exhausted, again, reflect on what sort of thoughts you've been having. And if your day has been filled with a lot of thoughts, negative thoughts about others and obsession about yourself, then that shows you that all that type of thinking just leads to mental exhaustion and unhappiness. If your mind feels lighter by the end of the day, again, reflect back and think, what have I been thinking about over the day? And check. And you'll, what you'll generally find is that the mind has been much more positive and that thinking obsessed with yourself has been less. <laughs> 